Hi guys, I'm in a hurry, so I'm not going to do a full build video here. We're going to go out to the seaside and I want to try putting a camera on one of my kites. So I've got a square of plywood here, uh, it's about an eighth of an inch deep. Um, let's have a quick look. That's about eight and a half inches square. Drawn a line corner to corner. Then in the middle, I've measured the size of my sports camera here. Uh, it's actually centimeters, wasn't it? Six centimeters by four centimeters I've marked out. And the idea is that will actually lay in there just like that. So the lens actually holds it in place. I'll put some rubber bands around it just to make sure it doesn't drop out. Now I'm not worried about the angle or anything, I just want to get something up in the sky as quickly as I can. So I've got to put four screw eyes, one in each corner, and then you have to rig up um, a bit like a hammock really, a series of lines. Uh, I've copied somebody else's here, uh, Rod, Rod Reed I looked at on the internet on YouTube. He numbers them up one, two, three, four and then going up to your line if you call one end A and the other end B then you go A to one, one to B, B through a ring in the middle to four, four to A2 or A which is back at the string then from there, through the ring again, and down to two. Uh, where are we? Yeah, one, two, three. Yeah. Uh, four to two. Oh, I've lost, lost track. Ah, oh, never mind. There you go. A1, 1B1. Like so. So I'll rig that up and we'll see if it works. I've trimmed a little bit round the edges there just to try and reduce its wind uh, resistance a bit. I mean that's going to be fairly insignificant the bits that I've cut off. But uh, it might improve it a bit. So there we go. I've put a couple of little hooks on there to hold the camera in place because it can't go through might bounce out, so rubber bands across there will just hold it in place. Just back from the beach. That was the finished article. I don't think I actually showed you it before I went. Didn't work as well as I'd hoped, but to be fair, I think it probably took me less than 10 minutes to put it together, because we were in a bit of a rush to go out. So I think the cord that I used may not have been the right cord. It doesn't slide through the loops quite as freely as I would have hoped. And I think I should have used uh, extra loops at the top here, metal rings, because with them running over each other, because I've got them both through the same position, they restrict the free movement as well. So a few changes to make before we try it again. But it was a beautiful day as far as the wind goes. So we'll have a look at the video and see what happened.
Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.